What's up everyone, this is Jack Swift from Windows Phone Hacker and I'm just going to show you my uh, latest version of the Dynamic Background application. Uh, so I released this a long time ago and it got a bit of attention when I first released it as sort of an experimental application and then it sort of uh, you know, died down both from development and perhaps usage points. Um, uh, but I recently picked it back up and said, you know, hey, this is actually kind of useful to sort of customize the device, uh, make it a little more dynamic. So. Uh, really, the main feature I sort of wanted to highlight was the uh, using the Bing background, just because it seems to make sense to me. You know, you might, uh, if you don't particularly have a specific background on your phone, you might want to have, uh, you know, a, a you know a background that changes every day. And what better source for that than Bing? And here we have the Bing background, and it's also displayed in the background of this application, just to sort of pretty up the UI a little bit. Um, and then, of course, if you do have a set of images that you want to use and have them change throughout the day, you can go over to the slideshow option, which has um, photos that you can go ahead and add to. And we'll just go through some photos I took. And here we have a list of photos that it'll cycle through in order and set as your background. Um, one other thing I added in is something that was very much requested in the original version, which is the option to change the update frequency. Um, so you can slide this little dragger down here, and then um, you can select the frequency uh, for it to update your background of your lock screen. Um, so that's you know it's sort of a no duh feature, but it sort of helps if you want to uh, if you want it more frequent than 30 minutes or more than 30 minutes. You know you can have that. Um, dynamic change to your background on a set interval. And then of course, uh, once you're done with it, you just tap save, and with that, then it goes ahead and updates your background. Let's wait for it to load. And there we have my background. Um, and of course, if you went and chose the Bing background and saved that, then going back to the lock screen, it would change it all every day that the Bing background changes over to the latest Bing background. Other than that, the application is you know pretty simple. You just sort of set it and forget about it, except for that annoying limitation in the OS where you'd have to open up the application at least every two weeks just to keep the background task running. But really you just sort of set it up and forget about it and it'll keep your phone nice and pretty uh, for the next two weeks or however you continue to use it. Um, so hopefully you like the application and if you have any feedback or things you'd uh, like to see added to it, be sure to let me know. And uh, other than that, have a great weekend.